Prashant from digitalaccessplans.com and wicketfullplugins.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how to install the DAP Shopping Cart plugin. The first step is to download the Shopping Cart plugin from your members area on wicketcoolplugins.com site. So when you visit your downloads page, you will notice that there are two plugins, WCP Licensing plugin and the DAP Shopping Cart plugin. If you are already using some other Wicked Cool plugin from our site and have the licensing plugin active, then you can just skip that step. If not, make sure to download the licensing plugin. You can install it to WordPress like any other WordPress plugin. Now, DAP Shopping Cart plugin also can be installed to WordPress like any other WordPress plugin. So download these two zip files and uh, go to your WordPress admin panel, plugins, add new, and it will bring up this install page. Click on upload, browse to the folder where you downloaded the zip files and then install both shopping cart zip file as well as the WCP licensing uh, zip file. And when you click on install now, it will complete the installation. Then you, when you visit the plugins, you will notice the DAP shopping cart. Make sure to activate it and you will notice WCP licensing plugin here and make sure to activate it. When you activate the plugin, you will notice that under settings, there's a new option for Wicked Cool Plugins license key. Click on that and enter your license key. You can get the license key when you download the plugins from your downloads page. You will notice the license key right there at the top on this page. Copy that and insert it here and save it. After you have saved it, when you add or edit any WordPress page or post in the visual editor tab, you will notice that there is a new option for using the shopping cart. Now, this editor button will allow you to configure the buy now page for the shopping cart. Now we are not going to go into details of what the buy now page does or looks like, but basically it's going to show a page like this where you can configure the various buy now options and uh, we'll cover the details in a different video. But if the installation has gone through successfully, then you should notice uh, SC for shopping cart icon right here uh, in the visual tab. Now that's it as far as the shopping cart installation is concerned. Uh, next we are going to take a look at what else you need to use the shopping cart. 